Guys, this is Hotspot Mini One, and in this video, I will be showing you how to install the Timber mod for Minecraft 1.4.7 and 1.4.6. Okay, so guys, um, this is a fairly simple thing to do. So just follow my easy steps, and um, it should work for you. Okay, so guys, um, so click the links in the description. The Timber mod Minecraft DL Timber mod page, then Minecraft Forge Minecraft. Forge mod loader FML. Okay, so guys, just wanna scroll down to the very bottom just to the place where it says. Oh, I just did that. Fail. Okay, so just scroll down to the place where it says download. Download Timber mod now. There it is. Download Timber mod for Minecraft 1.4.7 and 1.4.6 now. Click right there. And we'll say Timber. So, um, guys, I already have it installed on my desktop, but what you have to do is just, um, wait five seconds and press on the add fly page, then click to hot, a hot fly, just press regular download, and you have to wait another 15 seconds, which is kind of crappy, but it does not matter. So, we'll give you that in the description, then the second page is Forge Mod Loader FML. So, what you want to do is keep scrolling down, sorry, to download Forge Mod Loader FML. So Forge Modeler FML now. Okay, guys, uh, that is a uh, kind of video. Uh, if someone gave me this link. Well, actually, this website did, but it didn't even work. So, um, I'll try this one. There we go. Just press that. Press scroll down to Universal and press download from server one. And it is direct download on like uh, first one. And then just drag that straight onto your desktop right here. And you will shrink those. What you want to do is if you're on a Mac, sorry, I just want to get through this if Mac people can understand. Uh, you want to go into your username, which won't be here, but it'll look like that, in a way, uh, sort of. Then, um, t then there'll be a library, but if you cannot even find your username, you want to do is shift command G and type slash library. The search bar will come up and you type slash library. Okay, but then uh, you want to go into application support, then Minecraft. Then uh, you'll be where we're getting now. Okay, so if you're on Windows, you want to type the percent app data percent which is shift 5 app d a t a percent percent app data percent i'm going to dot minecraft and you want to go into your bin then you wanna um well actually if you know that you have mods installed previously then what you want to do is delete all the files that you won't, don't want which would be um, everything except for texture packs, saves, and maybe last o login options. But honestly, guys, I don't I already. I don't have any mods. I'm sure of that because I did it before. So guys, what you want to do is you want to go into your bin. Then you want to right-click on Minecraft at Jar and click open with WinRAR Archiver. Most people have WinRAR 7-zip or set or WinZip, but if you don't have it, just search it. WinRAR, WinRAR is the best because uh, WinZip is a trial; it'll run out eventually, and 7-zip is fine. But this is easiest to use. So, guys, I'll just put that in the corner. What I'm gonna do is open up Minecraft Forge Universal and drag everything. From everything from Minecraft Forge into Minecraft.jar. Okay. And you want to go to Minecraft Forge. You want to go to 
oh, fail, sorry, go into timber mod, and it says 1.4.6, but believe me guys, it is 1.4.7, they're exactly the same, they work the same way. Okay, so, um, then you want to drag everything from timber mod into minecraft.jar. Okay. You want to delete uh, MET INF, Meta Ink. You must delete that or it will not work. Okay, so get in there. And then, um, let's run our Minecraft. Go log in. Okay, uh, what just happened there is something that you need to do. Okay, so um, all the mods are installed. Uh, go into modem creatures, or just go into any world you want. And be like Jacob's Hardcore Survival or something. Um, and guys, okay, I'll go to another tree. Sorry, yeah, it's so laggy when I record, it's just ridiculous. Okay, um, just cutting this tree down. Okay, um,. Yeah, it's weird. Well, anyway, guys, that's how you install it, and it should work for you. It's just I think uh, I messed something up. So, guys, uh, please thank you very much. And I didn't mess something up. It will work for you. Okay, thank you, guys. Sorry.